A vexing problem of animal attacks in one community led to Neighborhood Watch Association amping up its efforts in creating a safe environment for all. Lloyd Allen has more. I'm seeing a, a sharp increase in animal attacks over the past 12 months. Um, it's to a point where um, we have to, have to take um, stern steps. President of the One Stapleton Association, Glenville Johnson, says some residents of the community in recent months have been plagued with a number of close calls with canines. Persons were uh, um, attacked, persons were walking during the mornings, and dogs would have been about and ran up on them. And attacks consist of physical attacks, but it's also psychological, you know. Realizing that enforcement was needed, he says the association reached out to a number of groups. We have reached out to um, Animal Control, Ms. Jones, and I've spoken with Director Price from the Ministry of Agriculture. And I've also spoken with um, Superintendent Minister from the Grove Police Station, and we have partnered to combat this problem. Johnson says the growing population of the community consists of quiet, middle-income families or professionals with many desiring to exercise. We have a, a huge park here and early in the morning um, we, we would have numerous residents that would want to walk and also they would frequent the uh, McKinney Avenue um, strip but because of the animals that are roaming about uh, persons have changed their schedule drastically. Some persons don't walk anymore. Acknowledging that some persons take on pets for comfort, safety, and other reasons, the association gives this advice to current or future pet owners. What is required of you is to have your um, yard fenced in. Um, so you, you need to have that. Also, the animal should not be able to jump over or dig under your, your um, um, fence. And so you still have to make sure that even though it's fenced in, it's still secured. And also, if you're walking your animal, um, it should be on a short, short leash. Johnson says every resident deserves the ride to safety, but again, reminds pet owners to consider the other members of their community, which also includes children. For the Bahamas Tonight, I'm Lloyd Allen. Honey, everything okay? Uh, everything's fine. Shop online for free in-store pickup in two hours or less.